Hi, my name is Emily Yoon from The Pally Voice. During the past few weeks, I've been noticing that blue light glasses are gaining a lot of attention because we're having to stay indoors and look at our screens for longer periods of time to do work. Initially, I didn't really know what blue light glasses were, so I contacted Dr. Michael Lee of Palo Alto Vision Optometry for some more information. According to Dr. Lee, blue light glasses reflect some blue light, reducing the amount that reaches your eyes. And one short-term benefit of this is that our body is able to produce more melatonin, which is a hormone that regulates our sleep cycle. So with all of this information about blue light glasses, I want to try them out for a week and see if I can feel any differences in either my sleep cycle or my overall eye health. Today is Tuesday and it is day one of wearing blue light glasses. I've been wearing these for a few hours now and I haven't noticed anything significantly different with my eyesight. But one thing that I did notice is that these fall down really easily and I've been doing this all day long. And maybe it's just because I don't wear glasses daily so I'm kind of noticing it a little bit more but my first impression of these glasses is that they are a little bit uncomfortable to wear. So it's Thursday and it's day three of wearing blue light glasses and I'm still yet to see any big differences with my eyesight. I feel like I may be falling asleep a little bit faster but I'm gonna wait till the end of the week to make a final say on that. But I think one of the reasons I haven't been seeing a big difference in my eyesight is because I haven't been looking at a screen for very long periods of time. And usually when I do this, my eyes get sore after like an hour or so. So today I'm actually gonna do some schoolwork and see if these glasses help with the soreness. Okay, I'm finally done with all of my schoolwork for the day and I lasted about two hours or so without having any soreness in my eyes, which is much better than usual. So I think these glasses did help a little bit with that. It's now Saturday and it's day five of wearing the light glasses. I was just watching some TV and it's kind of dark right now. And usually when I do this, I get like small headaches, but I've been watching for about an hour or two and my eyes have been completely fine and I have not gotten any headaches. So I think that's pretty good. And I feel like these glasses have definitely grown on me. At first they were a little awkward, but now I just wear them the entire day and I kind of forget that I'm even wearing them. So today is Tuesday and it is the last day of wearing blue light glasses. I actually did not wear them at all today because I wanted to see if I could tell a difference between wearing them and not wearing them now that I've gotten used to wearing blue light glasses. And I actually felt like today my eyes were more sore than they have been this past week. It's now the end of a very long week of wearing these blue light glasses and I have so many mixed feelings about them. So first off, I would like to mention that I had a lot of skepticism going into this because I purchased these glasses from Amazon at a very cheap price compared to other professional eyewear companies. Now Dr. Lee did inform me that blue light glasses are very beneficial to people who use digital devices often, especially at nighttime. However, I was still shocked when I saw some results with these glasses. I felt like my eyes were a lot less sore, especially when I was watching TV late at night. Now, as for my sleep cycle, I did feel like I could fall asleep a little bit easier, but there are a lot of factors in my life unrelated to blue light glasses that could have affected my sleep. Regardless of the small results that I saw from wearing these for a week, I don't think a week is long enough to test these out. I feel like I would have to wear them for at least a month or so to really get a strong opinion on these glasses. But all in all, given the situation that we are in right now, I think that trying these out wouldn't hurt. I would say first purchase a pair from Amazon where the prices are drastically lower. And if you wanna keep wearing them, then maybe invest in a pair from a more professional eyewear company. Thank you so much for watching and please stay safe.